In relation to Tier 4 regulations, uh, we have a full lineup of Tier 4 engines that will, be that will be available actually starting in early 2011 in the uh, a 7 liter product and in 2012 we have additional Tier 4 interim products that will be available uh, at that time. So basically what we've done at Tier 4 interim, we've taken the horsepower up to 174 horsepower, we've increased the power density. We're utilizing a single or dual turbocharging arrangement, dependent upon the power and the, and the uh, power requirements uh, for the individual applications uh, from an OEM perspective. Perkins utilizes uh, two different types of regeneration systems. We have a passive system, a low temperature system, and a active high temperature regeneration system. And that's tailored to the individual horsepower requirements of the individual engines and the emission regulations tied to those particular engines. Customers are going to notice that we have a diesel particulate filter which utilizes a low temperature catalytic regeneration system and that system is required to meet the tier 4 interim emissions regulations. The uh, diesel particulate filter that Perkins utilizes on the 4.4 liter engine is service free and really is designed for the life of the engine. It utilizes a continuous transparent regeneration which doesn't require any operator interface. Um, there are really, in, in the 4.4 liter engine, no additional fluids are required in the regeneration system. Now there are some other service features on our engines that we've incorporated at Tier 4 interim, and that we have hydraulic tappets which don't require service or maintenance, multi-V belts. Uh, we also have not changed, or we have maintained the 500-hour oil change interval, which is important from an end-user perspective. And we, in addition to the two years, 2,000-hour warranty, Perkins also has extended coverage programs which can uh, lower own, owning and operating costs or make predict, uh, owning and operating costs more predictable over the life of the engine. For Tier 4 interim off-road technologies, they'll be very similar to what some customers have already been seeing on the on-highway side with EPA 2007 emissions uh, after treatment systems and technologies. For the engines in 2011, January 1st, 2011 to be exact, we'll be using a exhaust gas recirculation system and then adding also a diesel particulate filter, the Cummins particulate filter in this case, and using that to meet the emission standards reductions. So some folks will have seen this on the on-highway side. We're leveraging that technology that we've already been using on the on-road side and using that to, to make off-road improvements as well. For Tier 4 engines from 75 to 173 horsepower, Cummins is also introducing engines with exhaust gas recirculation as well as the Cummins Compact Catalyst. And this is a different after-treatment system that we're using that it's, it's completely uh, passive. It's uh, free of any type of interface for an operator. Uh, they'll know, notice no difference in terms of panels or anything like that, lights, urea fluid. Operators will still notice the same power. In fact, they'll notice an improved response with their Tier 4 engines compared to Tier 3. Uh, we've integrated it so that our, our engines are completely uh, free of that user interface and the engines can run as normal. With Cummins, we have over three quarters of a million diesel particulate filters in use today on the on-road side. And with that, we've gained a lot of experience on how long these products last, the type of service requirements that we have. They're designed to last the entire life of the engine. And virtually uh, every user that we've had on field tests and demoing products have noticed just a clear transition from Tier 3 to Tier 4 products. It's been very helpful. And then on the smaller engine side for the January 1st, 2012 emission levels, we're going to be using a diesel oxidation catalyst. It's uh, the Cummins Compact Catalyst. And that is a completely passive-free system. It uh, completely is uh, simplified for those smaller engine levels. So that's been something that we've also gained a